Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my home, welcome to my channel, and welcome to my blog, Coffee, Tea, Wine, and Life. Oh, it's Saturday. Actually, it's early afternoon. I was out here earlier. I was going to film, but I decided to start my day with a mask, so I came out. I made a uh, vanilla smoothie. I had some frozen pineapple and oranges. Put them in. Perfect day. Had protein to start the day and some fruit. So nice. I thought, you know, it's not that bad out here yet. I think I'm going to mask while I'm out here, and then I'll just do some commenting on videos instead of starting my vlog. So I used this uh, Freeman Anti-Stress Sea Salt Mud Face Mask. And this is the color of it. I mean, it was black, black, black. There was no gray shades in it. There was no, as it stayed on light longer to get lighter. It just, uh, it was black, black, black. So I'm sitting out here with some glasses on that I really didn't care too much if I got the uh, mask all over them and I'm working on this and I, I knew that the, the true green people were coming today. But for some reason I thought it was um you know the lawn crap thing that they do but it was the mosquito spray so yeah so that was good but as I'm sitting there thinking because now instead of just having his eyes down on the ground he's up in the trees doing this and doing that and he's doing around the screen house which is right under me and I'm like if he looks up here at a certain angle he's gonna see me should I go in and I thought no if I go in and I stand up he's definitely gonna see me so I just kind of sat here like this and he looked up over the side and he's waved to me so I waved to him and he must have thought what a lunatic she's out here with a black face mask on I had on my headband with those flamingos that were just kind of going crazy in the breeze and he probably thought this is why I don't do her house on the weekends she's crazy but you know it's all good you know if you can't laugh at yourself well everyone else is gonna laugh at you anyway so you might as well laugh at yourself be a little silly have a little fun who cares if you look silly for 30 minutes right oh, so at any rate starting my day with a new pair of pajamas these are from uh, QVC of course from Carol Hawkman nice uh, summer pajamas here they're nice bright coral color I'm not sure if that's coming out online so of course I dressed it up with some touchstone crystal by Swarovski jewelry I do have the matching earrings to this so these are like peach and yellow but I decided to wear these ones with the bling these medallion ones from my vinyl box oh my god i love these so vinyl box i just did that um did i do it thursday night must have done it thursday night so i will leave a card maybe it's up here on that vinyl unboxing because that one was a surprise box so maybe and because this is really like my first year doing vinyl i started in the fall or the november box uh maybe that's something they do with every summer they came out with an extra one but you don't get it automatically so you do have to ask for it yeah but i'll have i had a link in that video so i'll put that link uh, below here too and it's it's a link from buying vinyl the box so it's for existing subscribers only if you want that summer box before it sells out using that link just gets it to you at your normal 59.99 dollars off you still get that extra bottle of wine if you signed up for that best subscription ever love it so anyway so back to my pajamas so they're nice coral shades they do have the long pants and on the bottom they're, they're like that kind of ombre so it's like this the darker coral and then it kind of goes up into like a like kind of like a peachy shade but light and comfortable um if um if I didn't have air conditioning in the house and I was in there in 90 degrees would I want to wear this probably not but for right now it's pretty cool sitting outside it's pretty nice too a nice colorful outfit right so yeah I had Mr. Griffin last night for a couple of hours his family had gone to um, a water park um, in Minnesota and um, yeah the kids had a ball he, he said so that was nice for them to do a little getaway and uh, so I got to have him for a couple of hours so he wouldn't be alone all day and yeah so we, we were having fun we were sitting out here on the deck for a while and we had a little campfire going and then the firecracker started and he was wild he was trying to jump over the deck he wanted you know he's not afraid of them but I think he wants to go after the people that are doing it whether to make him stop or he wants to help I don't know which one it is but he was just barking and trying to get over the the, the deck here so so we went inside and I thought well, maybe we'll try to you know do a little filming in there and my Friday vlog and I got all so I put all the boxes on my bed again and I thought maybe we can get a couple of unboxings done while we're here right 
yeah, that wasn't going to happen. He could still hear those firecrackers going off, so he just sat in front of me and barked and paced, and I'm like, okay, we're going to get him outside, which I tied, tied up on his, the leash that I have for him, so so he was good for a little bit, but I didn't want to leave him out there. I didn't, because he's strong. For a, little, for a little guy, he's strong. I mean, my 240-pound Great Danes, I could put on that leash, and yeah, and they just did what they had to do and would come back in. No pulling, no tugging when we went for walks. This guy, what is he? He likes 30, 30 pounds and wicked strong. He can take that steak right out of there when he's uh, after something. So I didn't want to leave him out too long. So got him back in the house and we just kind of put the TV on loud. We were watching Dark Shadows for a while. Well, okay, eight hours again. And um, what else did I watch? Oh, um, I had the Phantom of the Opera again, so I wanted to watch that, and I love putting it on the uh, my the Bose speaker type thing. Oh my God, love that! Love the music in that. So that was the 25th uh, anniversary edition. So good. So we did that for a while, and then he went home. And, but he's going to be back for a couple of times this this month as I take some more vacation. So I'm excited. I'll get to have him for I think I'm going to have him like a week and a half, and then a couple of weekends besides. So. I'm excited to have my sleepover friend, Mr. Griffin, come over. So hopefully he will be, there'll be no firecrackers, no thunder, no lightning, and we can do some videos together. He's, he's just so much fun to have around. And uh, yeah, so I think I'm going to finish my vlog. So I'm having a coffee in my best day ever cup again from uh, Sabrina and Mike and the Jelly Beans. So I'm having orange cappuccino, orange vanilla swirl cappuccino from Smart Sips. So good, but I've been kind of sipping it slow. I'm going to put this in the freezer when I go in the house, I think, and then put some ice in it when it cools down a little bit more, and I think it's going to make a great iced coffee, but for now it's good hot too. Alrighty, so I don't know if I'm going to go back in the house and start doing some unboxings like the Stitch Fix and maybe my Miss Ellie collection. I'm just start off in my pajamas since I'm going to have to be changing into clothes anyway. So we'll see what that's like and um, probably try to get them uploaded again during the week. So I want to thank you all for stopping by. Your support is amazing and I love each and every one of you. I appreciate you guys so much for stopping in. Hope you go out and have a fantastic 4th of July weekend. Be safe, be happy, have fun. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Hi everybody, it's Friday, welcome to Friday, and as you can see, I have got my special sleepover friend, I've got Mr. Griffin over, I'm so excited to have him here, he's with me all weekend, so I have him Friday, Saturday, and then he goes home Sunday night, so I've got him for a few days, and he's just been so fun, we've spent a couple of hours, we were going to have a going to have a little fire in a little bit, we actually took out the uh, camera, we were going to do a quick little video before the sun really went down, but kids next to were having so much fun they were uh, had uh, the teenage boys were out there they had their music going and didn't want to violate any copyright laws but anyway it's perfect perfect night it's just probably just getting under the 80s got a nice breeze here um, yeah it's just really nice and comfortable had a barbecue at work today um, one of the owners was in and, and he says you know let's have a barbecue but I don't want to do hamburgers and hot dogs and brats I want to do something really nice. So they went out and they got stuffed pork chops. They were like butterfly. They had to be like this thick. I have never seen a pork chop that thick before. And then he bought a rub while he was out and put like a kind of spicy rub on it and let it marinate for a while. And then he got some big chicken breasts too. They were really big, really thick, and he used that same rub on it. Oh my gosh, so good. A nice anti-pasto so we had pasta with uh, so it had olives in it and I even ate the olives and some little tiny cut up tomatoes were in it different kinds of luncheon meats and cheese and some onions and peppers and oh my gosh that was so good and then just a nice potato salad and yeah so it was just really a nice little barbecue and I left on time to well I was about 5 30 so about an hour extra a half hour extra so I could come home and get Mr. Week I was going to call him Mr. Wiggles, but it's Mr. Griffin. I'm so excited. He knows I have a treat for him in my pocket. Probably a mistake. I should probably put this right in the washer when I'm done. What do you think? 
What's this? What's this? Huh? Anyway, stepped on the cord, so I lost it for a second. But anyway, I am out here with my cup of coffee before we have our little campfire. It's hot, baby. So this one is apple crumb cake from my Smart Sips Coffee. So good. And yeah, so anyway, I'm just gonna come on real quick. So I hope everyone had a great week and a short week, but got a lot of stuff done. It's, oh my gosh, it's so busy. We have sold more this year than we did all of last year. No, granted last year was COVID, but yeah, so it, it's been really busy. And uh, Mr. Griffin and I already took a few walks around the house. We just went around the house. We didn't go through the neighborhood or anything. Just going out so we could piddle on like every little bushy saw or every little tall blade of grass. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great weekend. And uh, yeah, so we will chat again soon. Bye-bye, everyone.